And uh, <laughs> my desk is still fairly clear and I've taken off the uh, the cutting mat for the moment. A little bit of uh, something I've been working on. A couple of years ago, I did that. Which was my third attempt at a little plane. And this one flies really nice. Four channel, little 1806 motor in the front. Runs on 3S and it's had loads of crashes trying to do un under the uh, it's had loads of crashes trying to go under the bar and everything but it still flies lovely then uh, last year I got bored and I had a little glider and I made that one initially I tried to do it with just the two motors running with differential thrust or rudder and then nothing else but uh, although it flew it really wasn't very controllable so we added uh, an elevator and this thing runs on 4S and it's nuts trying to run in this on 4S is just so much fun it zooms around the place. I can do like, cause it to do flat spins when I want. It's a whole bundle of fun. Not the best of flies, but brilliant. And then a while back, I don't know if you remember, I built that 3D Vulcan bomber. And uh, that was with a, a little 15 millimeter EDF running on 3S. And, uh, well, this happened. Yeah. That wasn't a good sight. So earlier this year, I bought another two. I can't stop buying these. And they're slightly modified. Than the, uh, they look a bit sleeker than the older, older ones. So, combining my little 15 millimeter EDF and a little glider I'm now nearly finished and I this a 15 millimeter twin boomed little plane Oops. we got the uh, a 3d printed cowling at the back for the uh, EDF got 40 40 amp ESC on the front and it's going to have an 1800 3S in the front and it should just about balance it's going to be elevator and aileron only so coming soon it's nearly done just got to finish off the uh, servos do a bit of balancing pretty much done oh and add the uh, add the control horns haven't done the control horns yet so that's what I'm working on at the moment. See you later. <laughs> 